That's the way it is. This is the way it should be. How many of you in the audience have heard this before? Don't be shy, raise your hand. What about you, sir? Have you heard this? From the time we're born, we are expected and taught to do everything in a certain way, to use a knife and fork in a certain way, down to the way we live our lives. But what is this way? And if we do anything different, we are classed as rebels, penalized by society, and we stand out like a sore thumb amongst the crowd. Difference. What is difference? The opposite of what society deems to be normal. Normal to me is like a game of follow the leader. You know, when that jazzy music comes on and you start busting out some dance moves and you go round and round in circles until you stop, the music stops and you're faced with reality. And we all fall victims of this. We hide behind fake identities to cover up our insecurities, whilst the real you lurks behind as a dark shadow. Take Kanye West, for example, one of the most controversial rappers to ever spit a rhyme, and notoriously famous for being the husband of Kim Kardashian, the selfie queen. Over the year, he has made millions of dollars from a clothing line that's not that aesthetically pleasing. But he pushes the boundary of what pop culture is. He shows us that everything is a form of expression, an idea that starts with you. So if Kanye West can push the envelope, we can open it. If he could step over the boundary, we can leap over the boundary. Yes, it's been that way in the past, but it's not the way it has to be. So ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I would like to leave you with this little phrase. It's never the way, it's your way, it's my way, and it's our way. <laughs>